Hi guys, uh, this is uh, this is episode three of uh, On the Cheap. Tonight I'm going to be making uh, version two of the uh, tripod uh, camera phone camera phone smartphone mount mounting system for the tripod. So uh, let's get started. So what I ended up doing was I still used. Uh, use this, but I, I used it just to give me because it ripped off part of the tripod, so I needed a flat surface. So what I ended up doing was just using it as a flat surface to glue um, my real plate, the glue the magnets onto. But basically, uh, this is just a fender washer. Um, you can get it at any hardware store. First of all, we're going to put. Um, Here's my steel plate, and I actually just grabbed this. If you uh, remember from first episode, this was the steel. This was the steel uh, plate uh, on the back of the um, the magnets, and it's just a decorative piece. So what I ended up when it what I ended up doing was taking off the steel part and just grinding down whatever material was left over. And you want it to be, you want it to be on there good. So there we go. Really, it's a one-time deal. So get your position right the first time. Okay, we're back here. Um, I don't know my brain. I wasn't really thinking here. I still need to put on another plate onto here. Okay. So the because remember this is the problem one right these are not very good so we still need to glue a plate on here but I took I took a um, like I guess I took off the plate off the old those uh, magnets I bought from Target those three dollar uh, a pack magnets and I took the steel plate off and basically all I need to do is we're gonna sand sand this a little down here okay okay so let's go ahead and uh, glue this down. Okay. Let's glue this down. Okay, here we go. Let's see, it's going to be a one time deal, so. There we go. Perfect. Okay. It's pretty dead on. We'll let that sit. And now we have our surface, both of our surfaces. Okay. So, okay, so let's go ahead and stick one there, one there. Okay. Just two. So let's go ahead. I am going to glue these down because I, what I don't want is the force. I don't want to pull. I don't want to. I don't want to pull the magnets off the mount here. Okay. Okay, let's see, let's wait. So there we go. I know it's a little screwy. Sorry guys. <laughs> Actually let's just put one more up here just for We know two held them, but three will just be extra extra good measure. So we got our little Mickey Mouse back. All right, but with stronger magnets, and it should be, you know, and you know, with a little, a little more time, a little more experiment, experimentation, probably make it look real nice. So there we go. It's not too. Uh, let's see what happens. It's not too flamboyant. I mean, it's not. 
loud or anything and crazy looking like the other one was. So let's, uh, these were the quarter inch, took three of the quarter inch, I'm sorry, three of the three eighths inch by one thirty second and 52s and um, should be enough you gotta almost you gotta actually slide it off so there we go um, so not bad is it not bad I, I don't think uh, all in all uh, the um, the shipping is a little strange from this company. Um, not strange, just they have a flat fee. It's like five bucks, no matter you know how small. These are pretty. These don't weigh anything, but they still cost me five bucks to ship. So, all in all, I would say it cost me. Um, for, let's see, there's three magnets. I think those cost me like. Uh, about about six or seven dollars total um, six or seven for the magnets plus whatever plate uh, whatever plate you use for the back of the phone so you're talking um, I don't know maybe uh, seven to ten bucks I don't think you'll I think I don't think it'll go that high but you know so it's it's not bad um, and it's something uh, you know, pretty cool, I think. And so that's it. So, okay. Well, that's it, guys. Thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you on the next uh, truck video.